welcome to the afternoon show as Emily uh, lips to me because I normally forget about it. But our topics for today, um, well, there's auditions tonight for the play over in The Wonderful Life. I'm just calling it the play for now, okay? <laughs> Which is called It's a, it's a Wonderful, wonderful Life. life. Uh -huh. <laughs> is it not? <laughs> 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 now Harmony's playing the mind games on us. All right. He's like, is it really a wonderful life? <laughs> 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 but auditions are tonight in Mr. Korn's room. Uh, give me one moment as I am pausing this music. Um, <laughs> um, but auditions tonight in Mr. Korn's room. Um, just be there, what, five to seven? Yeah. Five to seven. So, yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. um, also tonight, sophomores and seniors, uh, Jostens. 530 to your seniors uh, is it just seniors yeah I thought I thought on the announcements it said sophomores as well maybe I just heard the wrong thing no because Josh is for seniors well it's all and, and the class ring for sophomores okay yeah I think you're right but oh well uh, it's either sophomores and seniors or just seniors um either or if your class starts with an S I suggest you show up tonight <laughs> so um <laughs> 5.30 to <coughs> Lord only knows when you're going to get done. Right. <laughs> um, then booster club meeting is what, tonight as well at 6 or something like that? I think so. I'm not sure. I, l I love that little European tone that you just got there. I think so, but I'm not too sure. <laughs> did I do that? <laughs> yes, you did. Awesome. And like it, it sounded pretty cool actually. I wasn't even trying to. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway. It, yeah, it, ju it just clicked. Okay. Um <laughs> another random um event that is going on um the Washington DC. No, why would you delete that? Because we didn't need that. That that was telling us what it was. But we didn't need to know what it was. If the title is the fun that afternoon show already. <sighs> wow. Okay. Um <laughs> <laughs> But the Washington, D.C. trip is November 5th. Buses will be loading at 1.30. <coughs> um, there will be a meeting probably the Thursday or Friday beforehand. Um, so that way he can give the information out uh, correctly. Yeah, he'll explain everything. Um, $75, <laughs> as in Emily's term, D-O-L-L-A-S-S-S-S-S-S-S. Uh, no, there's no R in there. Dollar. <laughs> <laughs> but $75 for your seat. Um, if you want to save a seat, um, 25 to finish making the payments. Yeah, 20 is to save your slot. I, I would do 25 just to be sure, so that way you can only, like, I don't know, throw 50 at Greg. Or my bad, Mr. Adkins. Yeah. I <laughs> <laughs> uh, um. I'm used to calling him Greg. I'm actually really mm -hmm. excited for DC this year because last year it was not good. Yeah, I I want to go. Um, I'm going actually. Um, we actually get to see the change of the guard this year. Yes. yes um, I am going to be taking a lot of pictures of everything. I will try not to get lost this time. Um, uh, I never <laughs> went, so I have nothing to say on that. Um, but football <laughs> tomorrow. What kickoff is that? Seven thirty. Yeah, seven thirty. Seven thirty kickoff against Indian Creek. Now, you may not think of them as our rivals, but we literally have an all-out brawl on the field with Indian Creek mm -hmm. more than we have a brawl with Beaver Local. <laughs> <laughs> Um, last year, we actually almost came back and won. I did look up the score on that. We were, I want to say, like one or two touchdowns away from exactly. coming back and winning. Yeah, we got this. Um, this year, I hope our boys aren't full of themselves like they do uh, after they always get their first win because um, they always get full of themselves. And then next thing you know, we just get absolutely obliterated. Mm -hmm. um, but I hope that their hopes aren't too high on this. I hope that they can maintain focus and, you know, actually cop another dub for us. Yep. 
So we still have his we got his chihuahua. Yeah. And you guys got a band show on Saturday. Yes. Uh, mm. <sighs> so tell uh, me, talk to me about that. Uh, about eight or nine bands are going to be there. Um, Beaver Local is one of them. Uh, we are one of them, <laughs> as it is the Beaver Local band show, uh, as I must include. Um, I can't remember all of the bands that are going to be there. I know East Palestine is going to be there. Um, we're there. Beaver Local's there. Um, I don't know. I can't remember every band that's going. West Branch. West Branch's band is actually phenomenal. I think East Palestine's band is amazing. They're <laughs> they're amazing, but oh, West Branch. <laughs> West Branch. <laughs> one million percent. Like, they're they're the top high school band that I would recommend to mm. actually watch their halftime performance. Right, you guys did really good last Friday. Yeah. Well, now we're switching things up. I, you're, you're, uh, we're not gonna tell you what it is. Oh, well, it's like a surprise. Oh yeah, it's a surprise. Oh, okay. But let's just say you might see us doing all the spinnies and you guys are like spinning. Uh, we're we're gonna be super <laughs> sassy. Well, if you're not super sassy, it ain't classy. Okay. All right. Are you ready to be sassy, Harmony? I mean, I'm gonna have to be. Yeah, <laughs> you have I'll to. Be watching. You gotta over exaggerate everything, Harmony. Mm -hmm. You gotta have enthusiasm. Yeah. How do you over? Uh, okay. Look, <laughs> it's called a hip hop. All right, you better do that hip hop. Just go back to your middle school years. Yeah. Just for like a few minutes. You want to see my middle school? Years? <laughs> no. <laughs> Instantly regret it. <laughs> um. Also on Saturday is the Hall of Fame alumni induction. Yes. Um, I <coughs> don't know what, I uh, think six is when it starts. I think so, yeah. Um, but I don't know what goes on too much there as Emily is, I see out of the corner of my eye, coloring the word. Come on, Em. We gotta get focused here. Come All on. Right. You're not <laughs> doing it, Rainbow. <laughs> 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 and now we figured out what bugs okay, harmony. I just triggered <laughs> harmony, <laughs> so I'm going to stop doing what I'm doing. <laughs> you have to fix it. <laughs> no, you will watch it slowly fade away into the mist. Ugh. <laughs> are you s are you triggered right now? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> are you pressed right now? If you don't know, um, harmony is our like super art like she is artistically talented and music and and well art everything artistic um but oh <laughs> 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 there we got some questions yeah so let's hop into that real quick okay <coughs> um who is the messiest person you know <laughs> Makai whispers underneath his breath. Um, he said, "Mr. Croxwell is the <laughs> messiest." Um, looking at the room, I would agree with him. Mm -hmm. Would you say like the messiest out of us, or just in general? Just in general, like in this classroom, who do you think is the most messiest? In this classroom, who's like the including Croxwell, even though he's not here with us physically. Or mentally, he's here with us in spirit. All right. <laughs> he's here with he's us in spirit. <laughs> he's gone, but he's still here. <laughs> he's here. He's just hiding. He he went down to Youngstown. I know. For those who thought he was dead, he's not. Um, you still can see the crazy Croxel <laughs> running around uh, frantically yelling, "Get me that BNC or that give me that Cat." Or <laughs> something. Where's my coffee mug? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Try and get off that game. <laughs> Other things like that. Stop being addicted to that game. <laughs> <laughs> um, but Emily, what is your answer on that? The messiest person in this classroom, I would have to say, is probably Croxel. Because we're, we're pretty good with our little stuff. Harmony? Croxel. Right. Um, is is someone gonna get that? 
<laughs> as Trenton looks at it and just ignores it. Him with his bulky stance answering the phone. <laughs> All right. In your guys' words, uh, what will break the internet? What will break the internet? What will break the internet? My opinion, Fortnite. Okay. We can't we can't hear you, Kenzie. Uh Kenzie said TikTok as she is sitting out 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 in the corner, um, because she doesn't like being on the show apparently. Um, even though she talks constantly and is but never we can't ever hear what she's exactly. saying. Exactly. You're not even near the mic. Uh, yeah. That mic doesn't work. Why? Since <laughs> like our afternoon show. Like have you not watched them? Apparently I not. Them. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Sorry, I'm in a super sassy mood. You're just getting ready for the band show. <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> You're just prepping yourself. <laughs> All right, well, <laughs> I saw the look that Makai gave us, like, um, just beware. <laughs> what do you think will break the internet? I have no idea. That's a very good question. I don't know either. Okay, so both of you have an I don't know. All right. What's the most useless talent that you have? I can play the flute backwards. <laughs> I remember that. <laughs> you guys did an entire, you, what? It was a fight song. Mm -hmm. During band camp, you guys played it backwards. Yeah, and it was with, um. there was one with Finkelstein too. Yes. During jazz band. Yeah. I can blow mm -hmm. bubbles upside down. <laughs> I used to I, I used to be able to do this I used to be able to play the trumpet with my feet I don't know about the what? Talent, but Yes I would press the valves with my toes <laughs> I used to be able to play the trumpet with my feet That is awesome You should have recorded yourself No that, that would have been very awkward <laughs> I'm an awkward person Like Anyway, so, what celebrity would you rate as a perfect 10? Channing Tatum. Um, mine would have to be... <laughs> like, I'm, I, I know I'm a guy and everything, but, like, a perfect 10, if you think about Channing Tatum. I know who mine is, but I forget... Let me let me find it. Like just that's just that's just my opinion. But harmony. I don't know. You don't know? I don't know. I know mine. I just have to find mine because I don't remember. So yours is. Is that the only one? Do you have anyone else? That that's the only one. Um, actually. Apart from Derek Shepard off of Grey's Anatomy, I don't know. I don't know his actual name, but that hair. All right, that's that's what gets it. It's the hair. <laughs> that's usually what how that starts is by hair. Ooh, look at the hair. And it's just it's just all luscious and like it looks super soft. Ashley Graham. Okay. I don't I'll, know. I'm going to have to take a look afterwards. <laughs> Ashley Graham. Oh. She is a plus size model, but I think she's absolutely beautiful. She's inspirational, and I love that. <laughs> Just my opinion. What has been the dumbest way you've been injured? <laughs> I know harmony. <laughs> 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 Didn't you like hit your head off a chair or something? I bent down to grab a water bottle during play practice and I smacked my nose off the chair in front of me <laughs> and it kind of broke. I think there's more cocaine in the back longer than the Yeah. I forgot you were telling me that. <laughs> <laughs> Fun times. Mine was probably when I was in, the one that I remember is the one that I was in elementary school. And it was when, like, your parents came to the school. And we had big glass doors. 
And like I remember like waving back and then walking into the door. <laughs> 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 like so, I would, like looking so behind Emily me, waving back and then just <laughs> ran into the Emily door. is the person that we all are in the mall because we're not paying attention where the door is I most really times. Wasn't. And we just walk right into the glass. Sometimes we break it. Um, if I could, I would play some videos so that way you guys can see what we're talking about here. But um, this is just an audio show. <laughs> but dumbest way I've been injured. Let's see. I fell out of a tree when I was like... I wasn't really climbing up it. I was just like really? sitting on a branch. <laughs> and the branch didn't break or anything. I like missed my step and I fell and I had a like a, an incision like down my back. That's not a dumb injury. That that's the only injury that I've actually ever had apart from my sister sliding down mirrors and me pushing her out of the way. I had a chihuahua bite my nose. <laughs> Ow. I was like five. The devil's dog. <laughs> I was attacked. <laughs> what's what's the worst commercial you've recently seen and why is it so bad? Let's see recently. the worst commercial I don't know, but the best commercial is that waffle commercial that I sent you. <laughs> I love that commercial um, so much. It's it's an ego commercial where he cuts up the waffle, goes into the bedroom, and his wife's asleep. Feeds his wife. And he's like, "Honey, you gotta try this," and just puts it in her. Hand. <laughs> it's he's like poking her with the fork with the waffle on it. I just I like think missing so her cute. mouth on purpose. And then she like wakes up and she's like. Likes it, like <laughs> she likes it, and it's just it was so sweet. Like that's oh. true love right there. <laughs> hmm. So uh, what Emily is saying, uh, <coughs> ladies and gentlemen, is if you do not wake up your loved ones with poking them in the face with a fork and with a waffle on them, it is not true love. <laughs> I will show you guys the video when we close out. <laughs> I know what you're talking about. I'm gonna show some. <laughs> uh, but Harmony, what is the worst commercial you've seen, and why is it so bad? I don't know. Excuse me. I don't know. I've just been binge watching Netflix lately, so. The worst. I <laughs> have not started Mindhunter yet. I just finished it yesterday. I have not started. You just finished it yesterday? Yes, I did. <laughs> I told you I've been binge watching. It just came out. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> We're all huge binge watchers here at PNN. All right. I haven't even started yet. Okay, Some so without spoiling it, is it worth it? Yes. Is it good? Yeah. Yeah, it's really good. Okay, we'll have to watch it. I am still currently waiting on... Lucifer. Okay. One more question? <laughs> okay. No more questions. Yeah, there's no more questions. Uh, we've actually exceeded our time limit by almost four minutes. Um, okay. oh, actually, almost five. But, you know, it's all good. All right, so we're going to get off here. I'm going to show Harmony that quick commercial. Um, yeah. I was going to say my commercial, but, you know, it's it's all good because... What is your commercial? Okay, so you know where the dude is sitting in the box with the time machine and the Doritos? Yes. I feel like that's, like, really dumb. Like, I, I mean, it's okay, but th I feel like that's the dumbest commercial I've ever seen. Like, like with the old man coming yeah. out and the guy coming out saying that it's... Yeah. I know what you're talking about. It's a little cheesy. Uh, yeah, and I just find it really dumb. But, yeah, are there any parting words as we wrap up our commercial <coughs> talk on everything and our binge-watching habits? And <coughs> I will see you later, and come to the game tomorrow night, please. We yes. Got to. Yes. Come see Chris yeah. and Harmony and all the other Bandians. 
Bandians. <laughs> playing the banjo. <laughs> Yeah, you could have just called us band nerds or. That's like what I've been calling you guys that since last year. The bandians, <laughs> so it, th- we got the thespians, we got the choir singers, and then we got the bandians. You're welcome. <laughs> Choirians. I, I will see you later. All right, guys, we will see you tomorrow. Um, sor- sorry, Harmony, you don't get to say anything. It's okay. <laughs> All right, well, we will see you tomorrow as we are going to be hopefully down at the field and back up in time for a show. But hope you all enjoyed this episode, and we will see you on the flip side.